butterflies how you guys are doing hello how you guys are doing i hope everyone is doing well thank you for tuning into my channel and if you have not don't forget to hit that subscribe button and hit that like button and definitely drop a comment down below thank you so much i appreciate you guys as always for coming on this nail journey with me and tuning into my channel watching my videos the comments that you guys give me the words of encouragement i always appreciate it thank you so much thank you thank you thank you please continue to do so and um again i always appreciate you guys so much you just don't know it means the world to me it means the world to me it wants my heart so thank you so much you guys so today's video is going to be um i well i'm gonna do a nail i'm gonna do a set on the my right hand which is my non well it's my dominant hand yeah, I'm doing a, a sale on my, on my dominant hand. So, uh, today uh, video, um, I was watching Long Hair Pretty Nails, Evie, on her on her channel. And um, in which she made several videos about this, but I watched it when she did the first video. And uh, she, uh, Kiss, I'm sorry, Kiss has their own Gel X version. Um, uh, dupe version so I was watching her channel and I was like you know what I'm gonna try that I like kids I love their products I love their they tips I love their they polishes so um, I got quite a collection of their polishes um, gel light regular polishes but gel light uh, in my collection so that's what today's video is gonna be about so it's gonna be about that unboxing so we're gonna get right into it so let's get that Okay, you guys, I am back, so um, I'm just going to get everything out the box right here, move my invoice uh, out the way, and we're going to get to these in a second. So this is what the box is looking like, and I'm sorry for that glare. Um, uh, it's a little bit of glare, the, the, the light from my ceiling, but the sun is shining uh, in my room right now, which I love. So it's shining, the sun is shining nice and bright. So, um, yes. So, which I love. But we're going to get right into it. So, this is the box. Uh, and I've been ordered this, you guys. I ordered this probably back in either early March or maybe February. I can't really remember when I ordered it. Um, let me see here. It tell me right on my invoice when I did it. Yeah, back early February. That's when I ordered this. I ordered this back early February. And I kept telling myself I was going to do it. I was going to do it. I was going to get to it, get to it. And I never got to it. So this was a, a, a good opportunity for me to get to it and share it with you guys. So um, this is the Dad Dupe um, Gel X Dupe um, kit. And right here, I like the box. It shows you, um, you know, it's up to 20 days days aware everything is included everything you need is included and it comes with a mini lamp and it gives you some instructions over here on how to um like use with the primer the gel adhesive uh the gel glue the press and you know to cure it and to also also customize the customize it the way you want so i do like that and then right here on the back of the box it definitely shows all what comes inside the box so, so you know what to expect i believe this costs uh let me check and make sure let me look at my invoice again this uh, i don't think they have the price on here hmm. they don't okay so they don't have the price on here surprisingly i think this box was thirty dollars i want to say i think it was about 30 bucks maybe 25 the tax probably came back to about 30. So we're gonna open it up and get right into it. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and open it up. Uh, let's see. Oh, I need my scissors. Give me a second. Okay. 
Okay, and the sun was shining in, but it seems like the sun's getting ready to go down now. So I may have to resort to my lamp <laughs> to put some more light. But um, we're just gonna open this up. Okay. And I'm just gonna get more into camera here. Just give me a second. Let me see here. Give me a second, so I'm trying to see if I need some more lighting. Uh, give me a second, give me a second. I am so sorry, you guys, but just bear with me for a moment. Cause I'm just trying to fix my lighting here. I want you guys to be able to see. So just bear with me for a moment. There we go. Let's see. Ooh, it's too bright. Uh, let's turn it down some. I'm sorry, you guys. Okay, there we go. That's good. <laughs> yeah, because I didn't want it to be too super bright. So, um, because the sun went down, so the natural lighting that I had in here, that's gone. Okay, so as you can see right here, let me just try to get... Um, a little closer so as you can see right here you get the file which I like you know you get the file right here that's cool you get a file so you got the the, the smooth side you get the, the grit side right here and then you get um, some primer and they do have on the box how you could use the primer and then you get some tips and we'll get to that in a second. And then right here you get um, the gel, it sees, uh, the gel glue. And then right here you get the lamp. And here's the lamp. And it comes, it's come back with a UBS cord. So I'm gonna plug up the lamp in a second. Uh, give me a moment. Uh, give me a moment. I'll be right back. All right, you guys. So I'm back and I uh, just I got the lamp plugged up, and I like uh, okay, yeah. You could put click it. So I like that, and it does come with the instructions. So if you want to read the instructions, the instruction right here says you have to prepare the nails. Um, if you can see that. So those are the instructions right there. So um, let's open up these tips real quick. And I think these came with, let me see. Yeah, they came with XL sculpted tip, clear tips, full cover tips, of course. So let's look at them. Okay, I think they give you coffee and square. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, okay, they give you coffin and square. So this is the square. And they're nice and firm, you guys. And ooh, real nice and thin at the cuticle. I like that. So this is the coffin tip. And just show that side by side right there. And then here is the I mean the square tip I just showed you. Then here is the the coffin and that's the coffin one right there and I really like that so we're gonna get to an uh, oh one more thing I'm sorry now the kit just came by itself I had ordered these extra because I saw them on there and again this is back in early February so I was like oh hey when I do this I'm gonna do a Easter set and it came with these cute little nail stickers right here as you can see and um, yeah, they came with these cute little nail stickers. I thought they was really cute, so, um, but I'm not gonna use them because Easter is over with, so I'm not gonna use them. So I'm going to um, do a nail set and we're gonna see um, what I come up with because I got some of the regular nail polish, just gel light. So we're gonna get into that. So um, 
and yeah so this is probably gonna be a long video and i'll be i really really appreciate uh if you guys do stick around thank you so much thumbs up thank you so much and again i will be just doing the right hand so let me get together see what colors i'm going to use see i want to go with i might just go with a regular simple set probably nothing on there just as just as uh to show how this works so um i'm thinking about doing that so we'll see who knows i'm extra so i may not even do that so um yeah, so let me see what colors I want to go with, and then I'll be back. Okay, my butterflies, so I am back. So I did grab some polishes where I want to use. And I remember getting these uh, from my local beauty supply store and my local Dollar Tree store. And so I'm thinking about I'm going to use these in some kind of way. And then I got my uh, top coat right here. And to dry my nails, I'm definitely going to use my little fan I got right there so, to help me dry. So, um, start right now, I'm going to start back pushing. My, so, I did read the instructions. <laughs> Let me just say that. So, I read, read the instructions. So, I'm going to start back pushing push back my cuticles. Because this is what you want to do if you want the nails to last. So let me to last. So let me see if I come in a little closer. Let's see here. Okay. Hopefully I am a little closer for you guys. So I'm gonna push back my cuticles. I got my cuticle. My uh yeah, you know what I mean. <laughs> so I'm gonna push that back. Cause I do wanna go to follow the steps to do this. So I'm just going to slightly push them back. And as you can see, I'm pushing my cuticles back. And again, I do apologize. This probably is going to be a long video. Because I do want to go through these steps with you guys. So I'm just going to gently push back my cuticles right here. And I'm just going to go right here with the thumb. Found last. Okay, and then I will be back with the next. Okay, so I'm back. So I'm gonna take the the fouling part. I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna lightly buff my uh, nail bed. So I'm just gonna light lightly buff that. And I'm just trying to make sure I stay in camera for you all. So let me just do that. And I'm just gonna lightly buff it. Just to make sure I'm removing any oil. I mean, maybe sure make sure I'm moving um, any shine that's to my nails wherever I have on my nails. I really don't have anything on my nails, so my nails should be dry. But I'm just gonna go ahead and just slightly buff that. And as you can, I'm sorry. As you can see, it's just a slight buff. And uh, yeah, so a slight buff. Because this is also in the instructions as well. So I'm just slightly buffing my nails. I'm sorry if I was out of camera. But yeah, just slightly buffing my nails. I can just move my nail wherever it's comfortable. Because as I remember, I told you guys my table is kind of shakily and wobbly. I can't wait till I get a new one. So, um, yeah. Okay, so all the nails up, up slightly above. So it does say, like I said, it says as instructions. And I'm just gonna see if I can reach for my brush just to dust that on. And then after that, I'm going to take an alcohol swab. And it does say you can use lint-free wipes and alcohol. So I'm going to take that and just, uh, you know, go over the nails. Make sure all the oils, all that stuff is gone. You know, so I'm just going to wipe that. So I'm just going to get, I'm just going to finish doing this and then I'll be back. 
Okay, so also here on the, it's on the box, it's in the instructions as well, but it's on the box too where you can, where you use the primer. So you can use the primer inside the nail and on the, on your nail bed. So that's what I'm going to do right now. So I'm going to, you know, because I did pick out my tips. I did pick out my sizes already for the tips. So I'm just going to take the primer and I'm just going to put down my nails. Uh, if I can get it open. <laughs> oh, there we go. That was kind of hard now. So, and I'm just gonna put the, I'm just gonna put the primer on all my nails. Sorry, you guys, if I'm not in focus. And I'm just, um, yeah, there we go. And please make sure you don't get none on your skin. Goodness. Oh my goodness, I made a boo boo. The primer didn't waste it. Did I waste all that? Oh, good. I did. Yeah, so please don't do that. I just did. Because <laughs> I just made a boo boo. I'm so mad at myself. Oh my goodness. Okay, I just waste most of that. Ah. Oh my goodness, I'm so mad. Okay, guys, I am so mad. I wasted most of that. So let me, I maybe had to be out of focus for a second, but let me make sure because I showed, surely knocked that down and did not mean to do that. And I wasted most of it. So I am kind of bummed about that. I'm sure I can probably go in my local beauty supply store or maybe Walgreens or some somewhere and find this primer again. Um, let, me, let me get this primer again. Yeah, so um, I'm gonna be right back. Okay, you guys, so I'm back. So I'm going to apply the primer on the nail tip and I'm just gonna show me doing that real quick. Ooh, the bottle is kind of sticky. Um, and it does say let it um, let it dry completely for like one or two minutes. So this per the instruction plus it's on the box, it does say to take the primer and the nail. And that's I'm just scratching the surface of the nail, getting it all in there. I'm sorry. Let me just get a little closer so you guys can see that. Okay, let's go to the next nail. Okay, again, I'm trying not to spill this because I've spilled most of it already. And it does say to take that in the nail like this, per the instruction, and just scrub that in there. Just get that all in there, as you can see. And it says, you know, let it, you know, give it like one or two minutes to let it completely dry. And I'm just, I'm sorry if I'm out of focus a little bit. And that's how it should be looking. Um, yeah, there we go. So that's how it should be looking. So let me uh, go ahead and do this for the rest of the nails. And I'll definitely will be back. Okay, I am back. So by me spilling that primer, it was getting all sticky on my hands and on the nails. And I'm like, okay, I'm messing up already. <laughs> I am so sorry, you guys. I'm like, okay, um, I'm messing up already. So now it's time for the um, this part right here. So per the instructions, it says apply a generous amount adhesive to the underside of the artificial nail tip and that will come in contact with the next your nail tip make sure to apply gel the gel glue to the cuticle edge of the, of the tip of the nail to ensure it and to ensure it adhesion and prevent the nail from lifting or hair catching okay 
so it says make sure you know you put a generous amount in there oh sorry and to make sure um you put it enough by the cuticle so it also says to so don't put the the gel glue by the nail lamp so it won't dry out so i'm just gonna put on this stick to y'all i'm just gonna put a generous amount let me see if i can get in focus Ugh, my camera is not acting right. Okay, so I'm just going to. I'm sorry, I hope you guys can see. I'm just putting a, a nice little amount in there. And uh, it's really thick. So I'm just going to turn my lamp on right here. Make sure that's on already. And I'm just gonna take it. And, and I'm gonna cure that. I have a spillage. That's okay. I don't know if you guys can see that. Um bit of a heat spike there okay and then I'm gonna do the next nail and then I'll be back okay you guys I'm back so I got two of them on already so I'm gonna put the third one on and it's working out pretty well for me this is so easy and very simple I am definitely um the liking this I'm trying my best not to make sure I keep the glue by the nail lamp as I'm going these on so again I'm just gonna put uh, like I said and this glue is really uh, thick it's not runny it's nice and thick and I'm just gonna put like a nice little amount there right there and uh, I may use a little bit too much and I'm just gonna turn my lamp on as you can see right there it's on and I'm just going to put the tip on there. Make sure I'm not getting any air bubbles. And I am getting a little bit of spillage because I think I put too much on this. I'm going to say I think I know I put too much on this. And I want to say when I did the pink, I did get a little bit of a heat spike, but I mean, it's it's okay nothing too much so I just want to show you guys as I'm putting it on there and this is going really smooth very easily um I really like it it just it reminds me of all of the rest of the ones like um model ones and you know Unijella uh Savvy Land even though I didn't use Savvy Land uh, I get just to use that kit I will I wind up putting it in my first giveaway but it definitely remind me of the ones right there. And as you can see, and that's how that went on. I'm sorry. <laughs> My phone just, uh, there we go. I got a little bit of spillage, but I'm going to clean it up. But you can see that went on really well. It went on real good. Really good. So I'm going to be, uh, I'm going to put the rest of the nails on and then I'll be back. Okay, you guys, so I am back, and they are on, and they look good. I got up the spillage. I fouled them, and they say after this step, you can go ahead and cut and trim and file them. I'm just going to keep them the same, the same, uh, the length that it is. Um, usually, I don't wear my nails too long like this, but I'm just going to go ahead and keep it um, since I'm not planning on keeping these nails on too long. But, yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and keep it like that. Um, but they are on there. They're on there real good. I did cure them for another 60 seconds in my regular lamp. So, yeah, but they're on there pretty good. They're nice and on there, you know. And, um, yeah, so I'm going to go in with these colors right here. I'm putting some gold colors. I did have some other colors in there, too. Um, but right now, I think I'm feeling these, too. So, um, I'm going to put these on. Then I got my 
top coat right here. Like I said, I got my fan to help me dry them just a little bit faster. But yeah, so I'm gonna go into doing that. So um, yeah, let's get it started. Um, so I guess I'm thinking, at least it's what I'm thinking. So again, let me just come a little closer. I'm just trying to come as close as possible as I can. And I'm just going to use this box just to rest my hand on. Oops. I'm going to use this box just to rest my hand on so you guys can see me a little bit better. And again, I got these polishes with my local beauty supply store and my local Dollar Tree. And this polish is looking really nice on here so far. And I did get some around the cuticle, but I'm just gonna take my nail and get that up. So, um, yeah, so I'm just gonna keep doing that. And um, let's see how this works out. Let me see here. Cause so I feel like this would look better over. Yeah, you know what, I think, let's see. Cause I think I'm gonna do an accent, uh, we'll have my ring finger as my accent nail. Yeah, so this would look better over that metallic I just had. So yeah, cause this is really clear. And this is gonna take a lot of, a lot of top coats, but it goes on real nice. So, um, yeah, let me come back with that. Okay, you guys, I am back, and I came. Uh, I changed it. I knew I was gonna do that. Um, I was looking at my yellow. Um, I had two kinds of. Um, yellow kiss gel like regular nail polish i have this one and i have the uh this one right here uh, so i wish i liked both you know um so i did come back um and do that um and i did do two coats of that so this is how the nails are looking so far and they are looking really cute so i am gonna go with a little design i thought i was gonna do something simple but i'm not uh, I knew I wasn't going to do that, you know, knowing me, I'm just, like I say, extra. So I got some gold nail nail for, uh, nail flakes, and I think I'm going to put a top coat of this on there. I mean, put this on the top of the yellow. So, um, yeah, so I'm going to go in with that. I'm going to try to put that on camera with you guys. And as these are drying, because they are air dry, so you got to let them dry. So um, let's see how this works you know and uh let me get my little box over here because this gold is a quick dry as well so i'm just gonna um come in here with that and i hope you guys can see that oh yeah that is looking very nice And uh, you can see that. Oh, that looks cute. And then I'm going to do it on the next nail as well. Mm -mm. And this is a quick dry. So these, that means it's going to dry pretty fast. So you don't have to wait so long for it to dry. And I have used these in the past. I just never put it on my channel until now. Um, I always... Um, when I used to just post this videos and little short videos on my Instagram and TikTok. I'm sorry if you guys, I was out of focus, but that's how that is looking right now. So I'm gonna be back with a final look and the, my final thoughts on the product. Okay, you guys, so I am back and this is the overall look and they came out so cute. They came out really cute. I really like it. 
They came out real cute. I did get a little hiccup along the way, but that's okay. But they came out so cute. Came out so pretty. And I did use some gold floors on some gold gold nail foils and um some that glitter. So um here's everything right here. All what I use. Uh, the polishes I use, and again, I did get them from my local um, beauty supply store and my local Dollar Tree. So I do like the way the nails came out. They came out so cute. Really cute. So overall, I do like this, um, their, the Kiss Gel Press um, Starter Kit. I do like it. I think it's really nice and easy and simple. It uh, definitely is not, um take you long to do um so i really do like it overall i think this is nice um, i know it's available um if i can find the link for this i will try to link it in the description description below if anyone is interested in it however um i might be giving this away so this might be included in a, in a giveaway um i had a, i got a lot of gel x um do kiss i got my uh kara sky Dell gel Dell gel x I got my um, my cards. I got a prey. I got theirs, and I got several others. So um, I might be including the starter kit, not the polishes, but the starter kit in the in the uh, giveaway. So if you'd like to see this included in the giveaway, definitely drop that down in the drop, definitely drop it in the comments below. But um, yeah, so they came out really nice. They came out really cute. I really like them. Tell me, let me know what you guys think. Let me know what you guys think of the kit. Let you, let me know what you guys think of this set. Um, that's my overall opinion on it. I think it's really nice. I think I like it. I like what they come with two different styles of full cover tips. They come with square. They come with coffin. And I love square, so that's why I went with the square. Um, so that's my overall review on this starter kit. Um, again, I will try to link the description below if I can. I mean, I will try to link it in the description below if I can find the link for this. So, thank you so much, my butterflies. Thank you so much for you guys for tuning in. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. You guys awesome. You guys rock. Thank you so much. Bye, butterflies. Bye.